Hi, Scorpio. <laughs> it's Roxy. I'm here to do a happy Valentine's Day spread for Scorpio Sun. Wow, that one flipped out. Scorpio Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Now, Scorpio, as you know, not every reading can resonate with every Scorpio out there. So just take what makes sense and leave the rest, okay? I hope you're doing well and uh, staying safe during this pandemic that all of us have to be dealing with. Please wear your mask, wash your hands, you know, etc., etc. Keep yourself safe. Well, Scorpio, during the pre-shuffle, four cards fell out and I took them. I'm using Romantic Tarot by Lo Scarabeo. Okay, I love these cards. They're so delicate and sweet looking. At the end, I'll show you a Dorian Virtue um, Oracle card that I picked for you. Okay, so the first card that fell out during the pre shuffle was the Nine of Swords, Scorpio. This is anxiety, staying up late, staying up late at night, can't sleep, um, depression, right? This is a Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. You could have been dealing with an air sign. It doesn't have to be. Okay. Yeah, this person could be from your past. Six of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Energy. That could be your childhood sweetheart, um, somebody you knew in high school, blah, blah, blah. Could be somebody from my, a year ago, six months ago. It doesn't matter. This is somebody from your past, period. And this person's coming back. That's the second card that fell out. Third card that fell out is a higher font. You could have had a relationship with this person, or they could be a Taurus. Major Arcana. All right, this is their deeper spiritual um, relationship, right? So you definitely had a relationship. You could have been married to this person. That's the third card that fell out. Hmm, interesting. The last card that fell out is the Two of Cups. You could have thought this person was your end all. This is Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy. You could have been dealing with a water sign. But moreover, I think you felt that this person was the one for you. And you didn't see anybody else, Scorpio. <laughs> Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Okay, so this person had a lot of passion for you, or you had a lot of passion for them. And um, they might want to rekindle the passion with you. They might be coming back, because Six of Cups is uh, coming back from the past card. The Sun card, Major Arcana, Sign of Leo. This person really brought you happiness, or you brought them happiness. And they may want to rekindle that happiness that you, you gave them. Interesting. The fool. Yeah, they might want a new beginning with you. This is a sign of Aries and major arcana. You have a lot of major arcanas here. Interesting. They definitely want to rekindle it. This is the, this is the magician. This is the, usually the trickster. <laughs> but this person has all the tools they need to um, get what they want, manifest what they want. It's going to be you or the person coming back. The magician is an Aries. I read it as Aries. Gemini or Virgo. So you could be dealing with one of those signs. Interesting. Wheel of Fortune. So the wheel is going to turn in your favor now. This is Major Arcana. Again, interesting. You love the Major Arcana. There's a big change coming for you. And this person wants back in for sure. I think they're in love with you, Scorpio. I think this is one that's really fitting. Reconciliation? Uh, yeah, they definitely want reconciliation with you, Scorpio. Someone from your past is returning to your life. That fits in with all the other cards I pulled. Doesn't mean you're going to want them. <laughs> that means they're returning, though. Good luck with that, Scorpio. You'll know what to do, though. <laughs> I'm sending you love, peace, blessings, kisses. Mwah. Don't let your stinger hit them, okay? <laughs> Please stay safe and be well. Thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time. Happy Valentine's Day. Bye, Scorpio.